Heat waves typically strike during the summer months when the weather is hot and humid. However, heat waves can occur at any time of the year in some regions. They often happen when there is a prolonged period of high pressure in the atmosphere, which causes hot air to become trapped near the ground. The severity and duration of heat waves can vary depending on factors such as location, climate, and weather patterns. Heat waves can be dangerous and even deadly, particularly for vulnerable populations such as the elderly, young children, and people with certain health conditions. Hence, it's important to stay informed about weather conditions and take steps to stay safe during heat waves. In today's episode of How to Survive the Science Way, we will give you tips on what you should do during a heat wave so you won't suffer from heat stroke and other heat-related illnesses. In some areas, many homes do not have air conditioning, and surviving in the extreme temperatures becomes a challenge for everyone. But there are steps you can take to keep cool during a heat wave, even if you have an air-conditioned home. Use box fans and ceiling fans to promote air circulation throughout your home. Opening doors in the house and using box fans to push hot air outdoors can function as an exhaust system and draw cooler evening air into the house. In the cooler evenings, open all windows and promote as much air circulation as possible. When the sun rises, close all doors and windows, making sure to close curtains and blinds as well, to keep the indoors cool for as long as possible. Take advantage of the cooling power of water. Fill buckets or basins and soak your feet. Wet towels and bandanas can have a cooling effect when worn on the shoulders or head. Take cool showers or baths, and consider using a spray bottle filled with cold water for refreshing spritzes throughout the day. Head downstairs. Since hot air rises, the upper stories of a home will be warmer than the ground floor. A basement can be a cool refuge from the midday heat. Eliminate extra sources of heat. Incandescent light bulbs can generate unnecessary heat, as can computers or appliances left running. Eat fresh foods that do not require you to use the oven or stove to prepare. Remember to maintain an adequate level of hydration, which means you'll need to consume more water than you usually do when it's hot. If you're sweating profusely, you will also need to replace electrolytes by eating a small amount of food with your water or by drinking specially formulated electrolyte replacement drinks. Try to visit public buildings with air conditioning during the hottest hours of the day if the heat becomes unbearable. Libraries, shopping malls, and movie theaters can all be good places to cool down. Avoid eating large, protein-rich meals since this can increase metabolic heat making you feel warmer. Know the symptoms of heat-related illnesses like heat cramps, heat rash, heat exhaustion, heat stroke. Call emergency services, 911, in the event of a heat emergency and try to cool the victim until help arrives. Also, remember that pets also suffer when the temperature rises. Cooling animals, dogs, rabbits, cats, by giving them a cool bath or shower will help keep their body temperature down. Look for signs of heat stroke like rapid panting, wide eyes, lots of drooling, hot skin, twitching muscles, vomiting and a dazed look. By following these simple steps, you can stay cool and comfortable during even the most extreme heat wave. Don't forget to wear comfortable clothes that's loose and light colored so you'll feel better no matter how hot the weather is. Like, comment and subscribe for more videos and insights from Science Times on surviving challenging situations. See you in the next episode of How to Survive the Science Way.